everybody, this is Alex Voss, your professor at TV eCourse, and I'm excited to bring a new television series called Kids Math. Kids Math is there to help you and your child learn more about mathematics in a step-by-step, -step, easy way that emphasizes the relationship of numbers, how they are related to each other, and how it's easy to learn numbers and math when you understand the relationship, with an emphasis on doing things with your hands, making grids and charts and graphs to help your kids learn and understand numbers and their relationship to each other. Hello everybody, Alex Foss here, class five, in our TV eCourse series on kids math. Now I hope you're learning a lot about mathematics and here we're gonna get into class number five, multiplication. Let's get busy. Okay, now here we're gonna do our multiplication grid for numbers one through 10. I'm going to put an X here, so this is multiplication. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, we're going to start out by doing the easiest ones. 1 times 1 is 1, 1 times 2 is 2, 1 times 3 is 3. So these numbers here can just be repeats. Going down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. going down. Okay, and then <coughs> fives are easy. Five times two is 10, right? And then you just count up five, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. Same thing here. It goes 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50, okay? So that gets us right in the middle. And then, since this is a 10, remember our rule about adding a zero? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, I'm off here. Oh, I'm sorry. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 100. Right there. This one, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and then 100. Okay? So I've got all these edges done. And then now we're going by multiples of two. Two, two. two times two is four. And then six, eight, ten, right? Twelve. And then add two more. What's that going to be? Fourteen. Add two to fourteen. That's going to be sixteen. Add two to, to sixteen makes eighteen. Same thing here. Four. Five, six, all right? Six, seven, eight. Eight, nine, ten. Ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. And then twenty. Okay, so that takes care of that. Now, the next ones are multiples of three. So this is going to be three, six, three, six, and then add six, three to nine. A 3 to 6, you get 9, and then 3 to 9 is 12, I mean 12, I'm sorry, 12, 12 plus 3 is 15, 15 plus 3 is 18, 18 plus 3 is 21, 21 plus 3 is 24, and 24 plus 3 is 27, and the same progression here. 9, and then this one right here is going to be a 12, 15, another 18. I'm looking over here. 
another and a 21 and a 24 and a 27 and see how I'm completing this chart four four eight and this right here is going to be actually a 12 I'm sorry a 12 all right 12 12 12 okay so we've got 12 and 12 there and we're going to add on another 4 makes a 16 adding on another 4 makes a 20 this one right here would be a 24 and this one right here would be a 28 and then this one right here would be a 32 and then a 36 and a 40 and so right here we're doing the same thing on this 4 20 plus 4 is 24 24 plus 4 is going to be 28 28 plus 4 is going to be 32 and 32 plus 4 is going to be 36 I'm doing addition to make a multiplication table right here we've got 6 and then we've got, uh, we're up to 30 on our 6. We add 6 to 30, we've got 36. We add 6 to 36, and we've got 42. We add 6 to 42, and we have 48. And then we add 6 to 48. And we get 54 and then we get 60 so it repeats down this way 42 48 54 right now we're going to be adding 7 7 to 42 is going to be what 7 8 9 so it's going to be 49 right and then the next one from 49 is going to be 56 and then we're going to add 7 to 56 and get 63 and add 7 to 63 and get 70 it repeats down so you got 49 56 and then, 63, and then 70 right here we're working our way across we're going to be adding 8 to 56 we're going to get 64 and 72 and then we're going to put our 72 here and then we're going to have an 81 here we're going to be adding 9 to 72 make it 81 and that's how we made our multiplication table by doing addition by adding the numbers multiplication is adding a number to itself many times over and so if I want to know what 6 times 2 is, it's 12. If I want to know what 7 times 7 is, 49. If I want to know, let's look at our clear chart where you can see it better. If I want to know what 10 times 10 is, it's 100. If I want to know what 8 times 7 is, it's 56. If I want to know what 8 times 4 is it's a 32 or 4 times 10 is a 40 and so here's my multiplication grid that I just made that allows me to do multiplication and I made the grid by doing uh, addition and so I want to give you an assignment of doing one of these grids that's 20 by 20 And once you have this multiplication grid, I want you to perform this assignment. I want you to find out the answer to 5 times 9 and 10 times 4 and 3 times 7 and 6 times 0. Okay?